Hey you guys, welcome once again to One Coin Only, and I apologise that I haven't been around too much this weekend, but the good news is I am back and I'm excited to bring you guys many more streams, so I hope you're all having an absolutely fantastic day. Just doing the final checks here, and uh, again, forgive my voice guys, it's been a big weekend, so I'm still waking up. We have an incredibly big day, a really big day, which I'm excited to bring you. Our first stop is obviously here at one coin only, and uh, we're going to be playing some awesome Game Boy Advance games, and then coming up after that, we're going to go over to Xbit, and we're going to have an awesome late night stream too. So uh, just loading up all the comments so I can say hello to all the boys. Uh, Gareth, Brian, good to see you there. I think I saw Rodney there as well. Thanks for coming in. Sorry if I've missed all your comments. Just say hello again. Jay, Peyron, Lurch, and Drachmas, good to see you guys. And uh, we're not going to waste too much time, we're going to load up the window here. And uh, we'll play out the intro, give everyone a chance to come in. <coughs> I think I'm organised now. And how was your weekend everyone? What did you guys all get up to? Thank you guys, thank you very much for all the love, all the shares, all the likes, they all really, really help us. So thanks for your support. And uh... Brian, I'm pretty good man. I just finished the DJ for the weekend. We're just happy to get back into the streams. Hello Jason, good to see you. Good to see you too, Payron. Okay, so this is Final Fight 1 on the Game Boy Advance. Now you've all seen Final Fight, but this adds some extra features. Uh, the more people you beat up, the more unlocks you can get. And uh, this is kind of more like the grindy Final Fight. The more you play, uh, the more rewards you get. Uh, I haven't done a whole lot in this yet, but we have unlocked some extra characters. So uh, as you can see, we can go to this next screen. And uh, we're going to play through the game today as uh, the Street Fighter Alpha version of Cody. Which should be a little bit of fun, so we'll see how we go. Hey, you doing, Peter? Good to see you today. Good to see you, JC. Thanks for coming in. Joseph, Scott, Retro, B, Bowman in the house as well. Good to see you guys. And I hope the picture quality is okay. Let me know if there's anything I can adjust for you guys. There's a few different food stuffs and, and, and enemies in like, too, I think, in this game too. Oh cool Gareth, nice one. The moves are a little bit different from Cody here. Oh no, they're pretty much the same. They just feel different because he's wearing different clothes. It's strange. <laughs> Oh, damn, Dragon Soft. Good on you for looking after your health and stuff, though, man. Congratulations. Picture is good. Makes me very happy. Thank you, Peter. And uh, we're dual streaming as we always do. We're on both... Uh, what are we on? We're on YouTube and Facebook today, guys. All the links are in the description for you. my man, of course. We're all family here now. <laughs> Hollywood in this game is a different colour. You know he's usually in the brown, but no, nah, he's chilling out in the red today. That's usually the dynamite, guys. This does look incredibly good for Game Boy Advance. I do have some nice filters on this game, though, Payron, so uh, the game looks a little bit more sharp, I guess you could say, than it normally would. But, uh, it's, yeah, it definitely looks pretty solid. And uh, guys, at Payron, Drachmas, J Dubs, and Lurch, uh, Gareth says his warm regards over from Facebook land. Says hello to you guys. There's some cutscenes here too. They're a little bit flashy, so uh, I hope you guys don't get seizures from this. This must be incredibly uncomfortable. Oh, wait, it's turning out not too bad from the stream side of things, but it's a bit flashy and uh, flickery on my end. Anyway, I'll leave that alone. Hey, you doing, Ryan? Good to see you today. Hey, good to see you too, Jamie. Thanks for popping in. And uh, you're playing the new Kirby on Nintendo Switch. I've seen that actually, Joseph. I would like to get a Switch and try it myself. Hey, good to see you, Nick, you sunbish. Thanks for joining us today. Yeah, you're welcome, sir. 
So there's cutscenes in this too. And Peyron says hello back, Garen. And there you go, I'm the messenger boy today. Oh, awesome, Ryan. How was your day there? Now let's get going. Oh. There you go. So you can see there's some little gimmicky extras in this game too. Also, what I really like about the next game we're playing, Double Dragon Advance, is it's, it's kind of a hybrid of a lot of Double Dragon games with fresh characters and fresh skins. So I have streamed that once, but many months ago. I'm looking forward to showing you again today. So we're going to have some fun. Hey, Ecto, good to see you, my man. Thanks for coming in. Now, before you guys ask, I was trying to check out before if Cody here had some of the same moves from the Street Fighter Alpha series. Um, unfortunately, it doesn't appear to be the case. He's just just the beat-em-up guy with the same skin, if that makes sense, or a different skin. <coughs> Alright, we're going to keep going here. Sorry about my sniffles. <laughs> Oh, thank you so much, Ecto. Really appreciate you, sir. Hey, you know what, Terrence? Not me, bro. I, I, I've got empathy for Cody. He's been through a lot. And I am Team Cody all day, every day. I think Cody is freaking awesome. And I think Guy is a little bitch. But you guys already knew that. <laughs> oh, you can actually get invincibility in this, too. That's pretty cool. If you're wondering where I am, I'm flickering because I have invincibility. Yeah. How you doing, Manya? Good to see you today. Yeah. <laughs> good to see you, girl. Thank you for joining us, guys. Make sure you like, share, and follow my good friend Manya's Gaming Fest page. Great live streamer. Thanks for coming in today. Uh, he was Payron. Yes, absolutely. Absolutely. Well... Ryan, unfortunately you can't donate to me yet on one coin only. I don't have monetization on one coin only yet. However, uh, I can get stars on Xbit now. So uh, whenever, I'll do three shows on Xbit Gaming if you'd like to send stars. Perfectly can today. But, uh, or when I'm on there. But yeah, one coin doesn't have monetization yet, unfortunately. But that's okay, we'll get it. How you doing, Stacy? Thanks for coming in. Good to see you, Tim. Sorry if I missed any comments, I was scrolling really, really quick there, I'm not ignoring anyone. Just copy and paste if I missed you. <laughs> of course, man, you're of course, you're awesome. We have some fun here. Yeah, I am really impressed with how this looks for a Game Boy Advance game. And uh, I'm very relieved that the, the quality is good on your end. Sometimes it can come across as pixelated, these uh, Game Boy Advance games. <laughs> How you doing, Austin? Good to see you today. Thanks for coming in. Ah, nah, man. I don't expect anything from you guys, Ecto. <laughs> I mean, of course they're a nice bonus, but I don't expect anything, my friend. How you doing, Mike? It's good to have you, bro. Where you been hiding? Man, Mike used to always come in back in the day and he used to always vanish. Where you been? Where you been? It's good to see you, man. Thanks for coming back. Uh, Richard, this is Final Fight. This is the Game Boy Advance version, my friend. It's got a few little extra features and stuff. Oh, it's okay, it's okay man. You're allowed to be girl. <laughs> it's, it's perfectly fine. And, uh, Dark, good to have you, man. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm feeling alright, bro. I'm feeling a little bit better. I'm a little bit sniffly today. Uh, that should pass. I think it's just because I've just woken up. So I do sound a little bit disgusting. I apologize. <laughs> uh, TC, apparently Facebook come around to your door when they feel like... They had the chance and they offer it to you. They just haven't come to me yet, PC. So, uh, God bless them. Hopefully they come to me too. I think we've got something really special here. But, uh, 
Yeah, right now they just haven't offered it to me, TC. That's okay. Thank you so much, Mike. It's been an absolute blessing, especially the last few few months when it's just blown up. It's been so awesome. And uh, I'm glad to see you back, man. We've missed you here. Chris, how you doing? We've got Retro Plastic Gaming here. Thank you so much for joining me, my friend. Guys, make sure you like, share, and follow Retro Plastic Gaming. Amazing stream page. That's all sorts of games, old and new. And uh, we always appreciate your visits, Chris. Thanks for coming in, my man. Awesome, dude. And speaking of other awesome men, we've got Headlock Gaming here, my partner in crime at one point only. Like, share, and follow. Thanks for coming in, bro. <laughs> nice. They're all cracking jokes over in YouTube land. How you doing, Kevin? Good to see you today. As you can see, the Game Boy Advance version of this game is a little bit easier as well. Um, but, you know, in the, the console versions of this, you get limited continues. So the easier difficulty you play, the better she can get to the end of the game. So this is going to be a walk in the park. Double Dragon will be a bit more of a challenge. Anyway, oh, stop, stop being a douche. <laughs> there we go, take care of business there. <coughs> This is a lot of fun, Kevin, honestly. It's great. There you go, you tell him, Cody. Hey, Clarissa, good to see you. Is there a boss book of more I'm, I don't think so, Ryan, unless I just don't remember. Feels a lot easier to beat up the car in this too. Ah, uh, how you doing, Chad? Good to see you. Evolution Retribution Gaming in the house. Thanks for coming in. Oh, oh Kevin, you know how much I love beat em ups in this game as well, my friend. I think this is only second, to be honest, to Streets of Rage 2, and only just barely. I think both of them are top notch. When I look at the Godfathers and beat em up games, I look at Streets of Rage 2 and Final Fight. Now I know going along that some more awesome beat em ups came out, uh, but they're the games that basically set the bar. How you doing Clarissa? What's going on my friend? I hope you're well. Thanks for coming in. That poor car, I know it's some bitch. <laughs> the car's a some bitch, it's okay. It deserved it. Ah. Oh. Hey Tiffany, good to see you today. Thanks for coming by. Continue on. <laughs> Alright. Oh, thank you so much, Garrett. <laughs> yeah, uh, today one point only turned uh, one years old, guys. I started one point only a year ago today. Uh, while I was on vacation overseas, and I spent most of the time in the hotel room getting uh, one point only up and running. And uh, best thing I ever did, obviously, a year later. And uh, it's been so quick this year too. I can't believe it. It's been absolutely amazing. Thanks for all being a part of it, everyone. Oh, Generation Gap Gaming, thank you so much, sir. Thanks for coming in. Another great page. Thanks for coming in, Ty. Oh, you too, man. Hopefully we can keep going together, my friend. I'm glad I met you. And uh, if you're over on YouTube land, please make sure you like, share, and follow. Subscribe to our Generation Gap Gaming. It's got some awesome content, guys. i tell you what I also love is your thumbnails, man. Your thumbnails are some of the best I've seen. <laughs> there we go. We're out of here. That was close. <laughs> Thank you, Manya. Thank you, Jeremy. Thank you, Anthony. Oh, that's okay, Ecto. You just do what's right for you, my man. 
Ah, uh, Gareth, hopefully it won't be too long, man. It can take a few weeks, forgive me. But I really appreciate the support, so let me know if there's any problems. Oh, you are, Aaron. <laughs> Yeah, Mrs. 1.0 is still around. We, we had a few problems there, but we're better than ever now, Mike. We are... Uh, you know, I think communication is, is key with everything. And uh, obviously, because we're from two different countries, that was a little bit difficult. But we've worked it out now. <laughs> so, uh, everything is fantastic. Hey Amanda, good to see you today. Thanks for coming in. You're becoming a regular face here now, Amanda. I hope you've enjoyed the rest of your weekend. And uh, you don't have to work today. It's Monday morning where we're at. How you doing, Joel? Thanks for coming in, brother. Alright. Oh, is this Eddie here? And we're gonna take down this evil donut eating mofo. I'm sure you can make it happen, Generation Gap Gaming. I've got my fingers crossed for you, my friend. Once you get to that point, you'll start to find that the subs will snowball a little bit more. It's really hard the the, the first grind, but yeah, you'll get there, man. Your content's absolutely amazing. I'm surprised you don't have more of them to be truthful. Uh, we're playing as Cody, but Cody from the Alpha series. In this game, Tony, uh, you can unlock different characters and features because we're playing the Game Boy Advance version. So uh, we're just playing as a different version of Cody this time. Oh, nice, Amanda. Cool, cool. Thank you, Dion. I really appreciate it, my friend. that one. I see. <laughs> Jeez, Cody's getting a little bit dark here, have you noticed? That could be a good idea, Epto. Could bring out my inner entrepreneur and do something like that. I oh, know, right, Terrence? <laughs> I kind of look as Cody as being the anti-hero, to be honest, you know what I mean? He's just a no-nonsense dude. You know, I think Cody and Deadpool would get along very well. <laughs> Can you become the man? Uh, I'm not sure, actually, Christopher. Street Fighter V is the only one that I actually haven't, um... The only one I haven't played. Uh, I stopped playing Street Fighter after Ultra 4. Not for any reason, I just haven't done 5 yet. Hope I'll get there eventually. Uh, I usually always get burnt by these flames. I got lucky today. I'm glad you're enjoying yourself, Tony. That makes me really happy. Thank you. In the... Yeah. Correct, Jeremy. Absolutely. At least from the start of it, anyway. Alright. Don't forget, as soon as we're finished here with Final Fight 1, guys, we've got our main event, which is going to be Double Dragon Advance. And uh, that's going to be something that a lot of you haven't seen before. How you doing, Mega Man Ramos? Good to see you. This is amazing, isn't it? It plays so... It, man, it's unbelievable. Can't believe they managed to achieve this on Game Boy Advance. This game here is is basically what the Super Nintendo version should have been. How you doing, Elliot? Good to see you today. Oh my gosh, I hope I start waking up soon, guys. <laughs> yeah, it's not, not for any reason, Gareth. I just haven't gotten to it yet, you know. 
absolutely double stream. We've got so many streams today. Uh, just a reminder, we've got Final Fight 1 and Double Dragon. And then we're going to go on Xbit later on for you Night Owls. And we're going to be playing some games there too. And then after that, first thing in the morning, I'm going to be streaming yet again to make up for the fact that I haven't been around this weekend. So I feel really bad in the DJ weekend because I can't stream too much. So Monday, I really like to make up for it. Oh, totally, Elliot. Absolutely, my man. Oh, there we go. Four burgers, everyone. Oh, and four pizza as well. <laughs> awesome. How you doing, Steve? Good to see you today. Ah, yeah. Okay, Dark recommended playing uh, on Game Boy Advance Jackie Chan Adventures. It's a beat em up on Game Boy Advance. I have tried that, sir, and I'm strongly considering it. That will probably happen in the near future, Dark. Good, good suggestion, actually. You've just reminded me. Thank you, Brandon. Good to see you today. Hope you've had a great weekend. Alright. Rolento here is my least favourite boss because he's nothing but a stupid jumpy jumpy man. There we go. At least we've got a four burger there waiting for us. Ah! Oh! There we go. Oh, he's almost dead already. This is no nonsense. <laughs> I think that's a normal reaction. Ah, uh, okay. Rolento is a bit of a troll bike, absolutely. <laughs> now, out of all the levels in Final Fight, this one's always been my favourite. I just absolutely love the uh, music in this stage. I love Abigail as a final boss. And I just love how this goes from uh, evening to sunrise as well. I just love absolutely everything about this level. Except the difficulty, usually. <laughs> well, I'm, gl I'm glad you emphasized with me on that one, Inu. I appreciate it. Yeah, that happens in the other versions too, Drachmas. That's, yeah. <laughs> Over my no, it didn't. It didn't entirely go over my head, Matt. I just, uh, I just didn't have anything witty to add to it. <laughs> no, I like to, I like to crack naughty jokes sometimes, but you know, I'm trying to cut down a little bit because kids are kids are always coming in these streams these days, and I want them to enjoy too. Oh, thank you, Semperfy Gaming. Appreciate you very much, Adam. Make sure you check out Semperfy Gaming as well, guys. Like, share, and follow. Also, Menus Gaming Fest, Headlock Gaming as well. Scott Retro B. Also got Generation Gap Gaming. Amazing stream community, guys, to support. Also got Gamers Paradise over in YouTube land. Oh, there we go. That's an extra life, I think. Um, I might have missed your uh, comment, sorry Joseph, I'm not missing everyone on purpose. Please forgive me, my friend. Uh, no, Tommy, this is the Game Boy Advance version today, my friend. And uh, Mike, the reason Cody is in Prison Stripes is because in the Game Boy Advance version, you can unlock different characters and play as different skins. And I feel like playing as uh, Prison Cody today, and here we are. That's pretty much the gist of it. Hey, I still love Prison Cody just as much as the original Cody. Thank you, Gareth. I really appreciate your support, man. Absolutely. <coughs> Alright. How you doing, Dwayne? Good to see you again today. Thanks for coming by. Oh, man. Oh, okay. I just died in... <laughs> Alright. 
the end of this level, I might have some water. Watch this, bro. Monster Hunter is a great game, uh, but the only Monster Hunter game that I actually owned was Monster Hunter Generations on uh, 3DS, but that was actually very good. I thought it was anyway. Oh, thank you, Steven. Good to see you today. Really appreciate the, the love. Thank you very much, sir. <coughs> thank you for being a part of it, my friend. Bernie, Bernie. And uh, for those of you who didn't end up making it to the stream last week, I played a nice little hack of this called uh, Super Final Fight. Uh, it was a Super Final Fight goal, and uh, I got to play through this whole game with all the Street Fighter 2 characters. So uh, you definitely need to check out the replay of that stream as well if you get the chance. I'll do it again in the future as well. Ah, uh, no, I haven't actually, Douglas, but uh, thanks for the, the suggestion because we love our beat-em-ups here, so I'll definitely look into it. Maybe remind me again in the future. I also want to stream the Bouncer eventually as well, which I've heard a lot about. Am I streaming on Facebook also today? Elliot, yes, I'm currently on Facebook right now as we speak. I am dual streaming today. So for everyone in Facebook land, the link to our YouTube is pinned in the comments. You can subscribe to us and catch our streams there every day as well. It is a big sub bitch, absolutely dusted. <laughs> right, so we've just got the one level after this, I think, and then we can go on to our main event. Yeah, Prison Cody's awesome. He's just misunderstood. Oh yeah, I'm going to stream more Dragon Ball Z. I will in the future, man. I love that game as well. That was a su surprisingly fun game. You know, Cody is just a good man that can't control his anger. That's pretty much a short story, Chris. But so many people have betrayed poor Cody here and pissed him off that, you know, he kind of just started taking the law into his own hands. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, pretty much the same as me too, Gareth. When it comes to Dragon Ball, I'm pretty casual, my man. Uh, yeah, I think I did, Jeremy, if it's the one I think you're talking about. Bouncer or State of Emergency as well? Okay, Simon, another great suggestion, brother. How you doing today, Shane? Thanks for coming in over in YouTube land. There's a lot of cutscene here. Alright, let's do it. <laughs> I'm working on it, Mike. I just need to be able to, uh... Be able to... How could I put it? I can't afford him yet. I can't afford... Hang on. I'll talk to you about it after. I'm not thinking properly at the moment. This head cold's really killing me. <laughs> ah. Pretty much, eh? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I wouldn't mind getting into it. Never too late, Payron, I don't think.
Oh. I just like wearing bandanas, I'm not getting affiliated, stop it. <laughs> yeah, no, I'll definitely get back to you on it in the future. Alright, cool, I'm gonna have a quick sip of water, I'm dehydrated. Some fish, Gareth. I want some caramel cake. I love spicy food. Dark is my favourite. That could be a good idea, actually. Get some wasabi into me. All good. Oh, I haven't had time to make him yet, Joseph. I'm getting there, brother. I'm sorry, my man. I'm working on it. Aw, oh, break the freaking glass, Cody. He's a stupid head. Anyway. <laughs> oh, Shay, that would make my absolute day if you could find one. That'd be awesome. Shay over on YouTube said he's trying to find me a Daniel LaRusso Karate Kid bandana. I'd, I'd either take a Daniel or a Johnny. Both of them would make me happy. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, I'm sure they are, Mike. <laughs> Alright, it's so the final level, guys. But we have another stream coming. We have another game straight after this. Do not go anywhere, party people. Got Double Dragon and Dance next. Oh, man. Yeah, the world's just too PC these days. You know what, you know what, to be honest, and this is a sad state of where the world has gone, but when I come over to America to do the conventions, I'm going to wear a black bandana or a green bandana for the same reason. I don't want to be accused of being gang affiliated, you know what I mean? So I have to pick neutral colours, that's just how, that's just how crazy the world's gone, guys. There's just so many things you can't do anymore because... Because, pretty much because we all just don't know how to get along. That's pretty much why. <clears throat> how you doing, Rotten Games? Thanks for coming in. And Cedric, good to see you today, my man. Appreciate your visit. Oh yeah, I'm coming over in September, guys, on behalf of Xbox Gaming. We're, got, we're having a big stall set up. We have a, our very first convention. So we're going to be in Connecticut, and uh, I might possibly make a quick stop in uh, Michigan as well. How you doing today, Jock? Thanks for coming in. Yes, yeah, stabby stabby. <laughs> How you doing, Steve? Yeah, man, that'd be freaking awesome. I'd love to see you guys. Not sure yet, Ryan, but don't worry, even if I don't go to Texas at my next visit, it will not be the last time I come over. There's some massive things happening in the next 12 months, so uh, I'm hoping to make two or three visits to the United States, fingers crossed. Cedric wants me to come to North Carolina. I will come to North Carolina as long as you take me to uh, a NASCAR race in Charlotte, my friend. If you take me to the NASCAR, I will come to North Carolina. <laughs> I want to see the Coca-Cola 600. Alright. <laughs> <coughs> you think so, Ron Gage? Yeah, the music's nicely remixed in this version of the game. Oh, awesome, man. Great. Cody's absolutely badass, isn't he? <laughs> Man, I would love that chat. That'd be freaking awesome. I'm uh, not sure yet, Roger. I'll let you know as soon as I know, my friend. Oh, thank you so much, Shay. Awesome. Really appreciate it, man. I'll wear them always if you have them, my friend.
Yeah, I, I really enjoy NASCAR. I haven't watched much of this season, unfortunately, because I've been so busy. Uh, but I love the NASCAR and Formula One. Um, before I was uh, on one coin only, I was actually a pretty competitive sim racer on iRacing as well. So I used to do a lot of events myself. Man, I would love that, Mike. Everyone's everyone's offering me barbecue. How can I say no? I love myself some barbecue. If you entice me, if you entice me with food, I will probably come to your state. <laughs> No, I'm just teasing Cedric. Would love to visit if I can, man, for sure. There you go, Cedric's enticing me with food as well. <laughs> it's like dangling a carrot in front of one point only. Oh, uh, yeah, fair enough. Uh, it's just a matter of preference, to be honest. I think out of all the Final Fight soundtracks, guys, the Mega CD version was the best for me. They had really quality remixes on that one. So I highly recommend you try the Mega CD version if you haven't. Yes. <laughs> we have a thing over in Australia, Terence, called the 5 second rule. So I think the sushi should be okay, fingers crossed. That sounds amazing, Garrett. Oh, true Mikey. <laughs> Kansas City has great barbecue. I get told that quite often, actually, Stephen. And Texas has the best floor meat, apparently. <laughs> uh, what? Uh, what about... What if someone's a vegan? Is there, like, four apples and stuff? Don't worry, I'm not vegan. I was just asking. Oh, I love crab cakes. I love seafood. Man. I'm going to have to visit everyone. <laughs> Good to see you over in YouTube land, Headlock Gaming. Don't forget to subscribe to my friend, guys. He's a dual streamer much like me. Usually streams on Twitch as well. So check him out there as well if you haven't. How you doing, Craig? Good to see you. Appreciate your visit, sir. Must be very early where you're at. What time is it, Craig? Must be like 6 a.m. or something. 6:30. Uh, I've never had a cheesesteak actually. Rodden Rodden Games has recommended that I have some Philly cheesesteaks. I've never had a Philly cheesesteak. That's something I definitely need to try. I don't even know what they are, to be honest, forgive me. Like, I mean, I'm guessing it's a, a, a cheesesteak. But yeah, as I said, I've never seen one, never had one. Oh, jeez, that early? I, I wasn't even close. <laughs> wow. There you go. I still get confused with my time zones with Europe. Now, not yet, Mikey. We will we'll do a playthrough again eventually. See how we go. <coughs> oh, I believe you, Headlocked. I believe you. All this food talk right now is kind of torture, guys, because I haven't had breakfast yet. <laughs> I'm really hungry. Uh, it's a thin sliced beef or pork with cheddar cheese sauce on a rock pan. We might have a we might have a place that does that here then. I'm gonna have to do some research into it. I'm sure it's not authentic though. This theme is 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 freaking awesome, Rotten Games, absolutely. One of my favourite themes in the whole series. Uh, Joseph asked me if I know what Old Bay is. I don't actually, Joe. And Neil, that's okay, man. I'm happy to have whatever barbecue you're offering, my friend. I don't need turkey in a chandelier. Maybe on Thanksgiving. And how 
you doing, Tyro? Good to see you. Always good to have you, my friend. Feel free to promote your new page, by the way, sir. Oh, Steve, I don't even know what they are, bro. <coughs> yeah, I could do some French toast. I've got all that stuff here, Cedric. Kind of feel like that, actually. Alright, too much talky talky. <laughs> Thank you, Mike. I'll check that out once I'm done. Yeah, keeping it classy, bro. That's what we do here at one point only. We're all classy sub fishes in this room. Uh, I haven't seen any sub fish hashtags lately, guys. We're gonna keep that going. We're beating the final sub fish right now. You need to hashtag it. Oh. Come at me, bro. Oh. Oh, I lost a lot. I didn't even realize I was low on health. It would help if I paid attention. That's the way, guys. Uh, Cervantes, how are you going today? Thanks for coming in. Always good to see you, sir. Final some fish, yeah. <laughs> Have I streamed Final Fight Streetwise? I haven't, Cedric, but it's ready to go. I really want to stream that game. I'm just worried it's going to flop. Um, there's another thing with Final Fight Streetwise. It has a few emulator issues. Um, I'll do it pretty soon, man. I am thinking about it. Just don't know when yet. You guys all confuse me sometimes because you all have different names on YouTube than you do on Facebook and it always throws me off. <laughs> Sambish Army, yes sir. Ah, Stacy, I love that. How you going, girl? Good to see you today. Thanks for coming in. Oh look, we rescued Jessica. Belga for uh, Smash Brothers, you reckon? <laughs> Probably. Uh, don't see it happening. That'd be interesting, though. Now, guys, if you're new to One Coin only, uh, you're pretty much gonna see once again why I hate Guy so much. So we're just gonna play this out. You're gonna see Guy here do his absolute fish move, and you're gonna pretty much understand what sent Cody off the rails. Absolutely, Steve. <laughs> now, as soon as this game is finished, we're going straight on to Double Dragon Advance, guys. So don't go anywhere. And have some fun with that. Might just take me a little minute to set up the window. I hope you guys don't mind. See, look at Guy here. He's a punk. That's what I think of you, Guy. Jerk guy, I hate him. I haven't, I haven't been able to apply for my stars yet, Joseph. Facebook haven't offered it to me, my friend. I don't know if it's because I'm from Australia, if they don't like my content, I don't know why. But uh, I'm only monetized through Xbit. Facebook haven't offered it to one point only yet. So hopefully we get it soon. All right, so we're just gonna click end here. Probably unlock some awesome cool stuff with this other extra playthrough. <coughs> Alright, we're gonna load up the next game. Cool. Alright, done. Next game. Double Dragon Advance this time. I just have to edit the window here just ever so slightly. Done. It should be good. Let me know how the picture quality is, guys. I hope that's all good. Yeah, I'm glad we're on the same page about this, Terence. That that whole guy issue is just the one thing I won't uh, compromise on. 
<laughs> I saw your comment, Ryan. You're upset with me because I won't play Bionic Commando. And ADD is all like, that's alright, Ryan. I'll play it for you. And I felt real bad. <laughs> I suck at that game, though, Ryan. I'll play most things, but I just can't handle Bionic Commando. I apologize. I think so too, Rotten Games. Alright. See how we go here. I find it very interesting that Atlas did this one, actually. Alright. Uh, see what options we have here. I'm going to play an easy game, because uh, you've got limited credits. I want to actually be able to go to the end. I can't remember what to expect. Alright, one player, double dragon. Alright, let's do this. Oh, it's okay. I, um... I'm just happy that you guys come in, like and share. I don't expect anything from anyone. Although, I appreciate all your support very, very much. Let's do it. You're still waiting for Bucky O'Hare? That's coming this week, Shay, I promise. Uh, the arcade version, though. We're not going to do, um... I was going to say, we're not going to do the NES version, but we'll do the arcade version. Love you too, Ryan. <laughs> I pretty much... Oh, really, Kevin? I did not realize that. I assumed it was for the same reason as well. But that does not change my hatred for, for uh, Guy anyway. <laughs> I still hate him. Ah, oh, man. Just getting my ass handed to me at the moment. And, uh, just before we get going any further, guys, is the volume okay? If I, if I need to turn it up or down, please let me know. Man. Got the sucker. Cool. Oh, nice shape. Cool. Yeah, we'll have some fun with that. We're gonna... It's been a while since I've played Bucky O'Hare, Sunset Riders. Uh, so we might do an arcade triple. I'm thinking of doing Sunset Riders, Bucky O'Hare, and the Combat Tribes in one stream. I haven't played Combat Tribes for a very, very long time, which is a very similar beat em up to Double Dragon. Hopefully, you guys like that. I know Tyrone remembers the Combat Tribes. Oh, really, Tyrone? It's interesting. I didn't. I don't even remember that. It's been a while. <coughs> And I love Street Fighter Alpha 2. Yeah, we're going to do some arcade games again this week. We've got a lot of content coming, guys. This week's going to be the biggest week we've had in forever. Between both OneCoin and XBit. Also, we've got Headlock Gaming coming back on tomorrow as well, guys. I know how much you love Dwayne here. So he's going to be coming back on and doing his thing at OneCoin. How you doing today, Harvey? Good to see you, my man. Yeah, they did. A lot of people say the Combat Tribes Tyrone is the game that Double Dragon 3 should have been. <laughs> I'd, have, I'd, I'd pretty much agree with them, to be honest. Does this feel a bit more polished? Uh, it's While this game is not perfect control-wise, it does feel a bit more refined rod in games. I'd, ha I'd have to say yes. Kevin doesn't like the Combat Tribes. Sorry, my brother. <laughs> Alright. Oh, that would be absolutely fantastic. Thank you so much, Christopher. I'd love some help with that, sir. Thank you, man. That'd be really helpful. Alright, another level here. There's a couple different modes uh, in this game, by the way. I'm not sure what each one does. But if we finish the first mode here quick enough, we might see what the second mode has to offer as well. 
See, I like to I like to play bad dudes, but two crude dudes, Javier, I absolutely suck at. That's the one beat him up I can't play properly. Two crew dudes makes me rage so bad. Can you finish that game, Tyrone? I've never ever finished two crew dudes. That might be a game to stream in the future as well. Can give that a go. Ah, stop it. Ah, stop it. <laughs> How you doing today, James? Good to see you. Thanks for coming in. Appreciate your visit, sir. <clears throat> By the way, guys, uh, just some extra news. Over on YouTube land, uh, I applied for monetization about seven weeks ago. And uh, I'm still waiting on a reply. So very soon I'll be able to take donations on YouTube. Uh, or Super Chats, as they call them, which is really good news. Uh, we're just playing the waiting game at the moment. Oh, well, these guys are a little bit different. Oh, no! That was a bit dumb. <laughs> I'll try again here. Uh, I do like River City Ransom. Now, this week at some point, Quinton, there is a version of River City Ransom on Game Boy Advance. Which is exactly the same as the NES version, but it has improved graphics, so I'm thinking of giving that a try if you guys are interested. Oh man. There we go. Oh, that, that kick's pretty effective, I just figured out a move. The missile drop kick is really good. Look at that. Oh, okay. It's kind of a missile drop kick. <laughs> probably, probably the wrong name for it, but it's still pretty cool. Oh yeah, I get ya. Oh man, that freaking thing! That's the second life I lost there. It's bullshit. Anyway, that conveyor belt is so freaking cheap. Let me get this whip again. Oh gosh, I'm glad that's done. <coughs> Alright, Steven, sounds good, man. I keep forgetting to... I'm getting used to the buttons still a little bit in this guy, so if I'm doing really stupid stuff, I do apologize. Alright. Whippy, whippy. <laughs> Jump and elbow for elbow smash. I don't know if it's the same for this game, actually, being the Game Boy version, but I'll, I'll try it out, Tyrone. Obviously, uh, the elbow smash was the way you got through the original arcade game easily. Oh, no, it still can. There you go. Awesome. Thank you, sir. It still applies in this game. Well, now, now we're, now we're going to not have too much fun because I'm just going to spam attack my way through the whole game. <laughs> ah. Hey Benji, you sunbish, good to see you today. And Shay reckons these characters look like Leisure Shoot Larry Rejects. Yeah, I can see that. There we go. Elbow, elbow. That doesn't have the same ring to it though. Oh man, see these guys have got a few more moves compared to the original. <laughs> oh boy. I was going to stream Leisure Suit Larry for you guys, but uh, for some reason it's not in our Steam store. They probably banned it because we have too many nanas that uh, rule our rating system over here. Yet they don't ban Grand Theft Auto 5, but they ban Leather Shoot Larry. Whatever. <laughs> anyway. <clears throat> I keep 
going here. A jumping kick for a reverse kick. Oh yeah, I know the one you speak of. Cool man. Yeah, I'll probably end up just spamming this elbow. It's what I know. <laughs> Monkey Island. Um, I know Monkey Island games are absolutely amazing, Mike. But I'm not the brightest spark in the matchbox. And I'm worried those games that require thinking I'm going to get very, very stuck on. So it does concern me. I would like to play something like that or Maniac Mansion. But I'm worried about embarrassing myself as well. <laughs> uh, no, not in this one. Good question, Javier. But this one's back to basics. Or maybe you can, if you can do the knee, I don't know how to do it anyway in this one. I do remember in the original NES version, it was both buttons at the same time after you land from a jump. <clears throat> Alright, let's keep going. Oh, really? You think it's weird, James? It's just a... It's, as I said, this came out in the 2000s, so it's just a reimagining. But uh, trust me, if you haven't played this before, James, give it a chance. It's a lot of fun. The music's good, the graphics are good. I, I do admit, Bimmy here's got a bit of a strange hairstyle. I guess he's just keeping with the times. As you can see, there's added levels in this and stuff too. Alright, got him. It's pretty much Double Dragon 1.5. That's the best way to to put it. That's a, a pretty accurate assessment. Oh, there we go. I can't remember how long it is. Anyway. Doesn't matter if this stream is, is a little bit shorter tonight anyway, because I am coming straight back on in a couple of hours for a late nighter for you. And that one's going to be big. Oh man. Oh crap. There's a few different weapons in this, have you noticed? It's pretty cool. Uh, I've, got to, I've got to rely on the jump kick a bit still. I've got to get out of the habit of just uh, using the elbow. There we go. That jump kick's pretty good. I'll right, carry on here. Okay, uh, over at... Um, I've got two games coming up over at... Um, at Xbox Gaming, I'm going to be doing an encore of Adventure Island 2. I'm going to play the whole game. And then once I finish Adventure Island 2, I'm going to be streaming a very special Super Mario Bros. 2 hack for you guys. And, uh, it's, it's, a, it's a good hack. It's going to be a lot of fun. That'll be the late night stream for you sleepless people. Oh yeah, I love this weapon. This is cool. How you going today, Danielle? Thanks for coming in. Hope you're well. Good to see you here in time. You missed the first game, but you came in time for the second. How you doing, Espen? Good to see you today. Oh, so there's an official date now, Tyrone. Awesome. Good to know. I will be streaming that game, obviously, the day it comes out. You will not be able to stop me. Even if I have to call in sick to work or whatever. <laughs> and uh, you know I'm going to get it first since I'm a future boy. Yeah, I'm not too bad, Dan. Thanks for asking. I'm getting there, my friend. Gosh, Tyron, you're just an encyclopedia of knowledge today, my friend. <laughs> How you doing today, uh, Timothy? Thanks for coming in, brother. How's your weekend been? Oh, me neither, John. We've all been hanging out a very long time for this. And uh, the art style looks good. Like, uh, they've, they've modernized the graphics but kept it 2D. I think that was a very, very good idea. Sort of looks like it's got a fresh coat of paint again.
And they've got a new weapon system too, where you can do these like overdrive moves at the expense of your health. And uh, they look pretty, pretty sick as well. Oh, I love original NES too, Justin, of course. Oh, this guy, this guy looks like no nonsense, doesn't he? Oh, I keep forgetting to do the elbow. <coughs> oh, it might be time to bring that out. There we go. Go. Got a few good ones in there. Oh, man, now I'm stuck. Oh, just like in the NES version, you can beat dudes on the ground here. That's pretty cool. Oh, man. You take that back, Jay. He does not. Justin, he does not look like Guy. He looks nothing like Guy. <laughs> Justin's just trolling me with that comment. Colin, if you would like to see my adventures of Bayou Billy video, you can go on my YouTube page. It's pinned in the comments. And uh, if you guys haven't already, make sure you subscribe to that. And you can see my fail video on Bayou Billy and understand why I don't play that game. <laughs> He does not, Gareth. Stop it. Uh, that is my personal favourite too. Rotten Games on YouTube just said Double Dragon 2 The Revenge is his favourite. It's my favourite too, but the NES version, not the arcade version. <laughs> How you doing, my friend, Expert Gaming? Thank you so much for coming in. It's good to have you. Just been hyping up the brand, letting everyone know I'm on later on today. If you haven't liked, shared, and followed Xbit Gaming, definitely check it out. We've got the Godfather himself in here. Ricky hates Guy. Danielle just did a hashtag. Absolutely. <clears throat> he is, Kevin. He is. <laughs> oh, thank you so much, Chris. And also, just a reminder, don't forget to check out Retro Plastic Gaming 2, guys. Streams every day, has amazing games. <laughs> Kev Kevin's trying to start an argument with me on YouTube about how Guy's not that bad. I will agree to disagree with you, Kevin. How's that sound? I've completely forgotten about that game, Tyrone. Oh, absolutely. I didn't even know it existed. That's that's really cool. <laughs> oh, gee. <laughs> it was pretty unfair, bro. Alright, we're back at it. For a split second, I forgot what all the buttons did. Oh yeah, that's better. Oh man! Oh, no way! <clears throat> oh, stop falling off places, Bimmy! Gosh, he's so uncoordinated. Oh, I'm gonna carry on. Hopefully we can still finish the game. I've just thrown away like three or four lives by falling off stuff. Hey Evan, how you doing today, man? Thanks for joining us. Welcome to the stream, sir. Uh, Kevin over on YouTube just asked me, guys, why is Guy a douche? And I'm going to give Kevin the most mature answer I can possibly give Kevin. The reason Guy is a douche is because, well, he just is. <laughs> oh, you cannot spin kick in this one as far as I know, my friend. 
This is double dragon one, uh, technically. So yeah, there's no spin kicks. No knees, no spin kicks. Uh, no uppercuts. Sorry guys, I kind of lost my way there a bit. I'm just going to concentrate here again. Oh no, stop it! That's far out, these enemies are freaking cheap. Alright, we're going to keep going here. Oh, snap! Kevin, Cody is just misunderstood, bro. Cody is mi Far out, man! I'm getting absolutely owned in this level. God, this is killing me. I'm going to try and stay off the edge, too. Otherwise, you get kicked off. These guys have a lot of hit points, as well. <laughs> no, get away from the edge! <laughs> Mike thinks, yeah, it does kind of look a bit matrixy, doesn't it? Oh, oh, stop it! Man, I've lost like five lives in this level. Assholes. Oh, stop it! This game is no freaking joke. Wow. We're going to get the suckers this time. Oh, there's more of them? Oh, come on! No! Ah! Oh, okay. I'm gonna have to... Is this... Oh, man! Not, mu not much you can do! <sighs> Alright, guys, I'll be right back with you. This level just all of a sudden got brutal. Ah! Oh! All right, we'll make up for it. <laughs> probably, Danielle. Probably. <laughs> How you doing, Mayhem Gaming? Good to see you today. Honestly, it's, it's nothing to take too seriously, Kevin. Really, more than anything, if I'm going to be per totally honest with you, it's just a running joke. It's just a fun little random joke that I made up one day, and I've kind of just stuck with it. It's nothing to take too serious. I don't genuinely want to offend anyone. <laughs> there we go. Gosh, that last level was brutal. Jump kicks seem to be effective here, at least. Uh, Danielle and uh, Jared. Gareth says hello to you guys over in uh, YouTube land. How you doing today, Jared? Good to see you, man. Thanks for coming in. Alright, finally we recovered a little bit here. That was torture, man. Oh, really? See, Street Fighter V uh, is the only one I haven't played yet, uh, Tyrone. So I haven't seen that whole storyline at this point. Oh, gosh. Yeah, we're doing the whole jumpy jumpy thing at the moment. <laughs> oh gosh, I got absolutely stuck that last level. That oh, man. Oh! One hit kills, guys. Are you freaking kidding me? Piss off with that sword, brother. Jeez. <laughs> hey Joey, how you doing man? I'm pretty good bro. This game's waking me up in a hurry. And how you doing today Jason? Thanks for coming in. And guys, got another paid shout out for my friend Mayhem Gaming here. Oh wow. <laughs> yeah, piss off you son bish. <coughs> 
<coughs> Excuse me. Okay, we've got the wood stage again. This one was always fun. Probably crack some elbows out again. Yeah. How you doing, Guy Forks Gaming? Thanks for visiting us, my friend. Appreciate your visit. <coughs> Thank you, Gareth. And uh, just one more reminder, guys, we're dual streaming today, so we're over on YouTube as well. So if you'd like to watch us there, link is pinned in the comments on Facebook. You can subscribe to us, and uh, we stream there every day as well. I might have to start getting the jump kicks going again, because I'm a little bit surrounded. There we go. I really like the jump kick in this game. How you doing, Hardy Boys? Good to see you today, my friend. Thanks for your visit. Alright. Absolutely, Gareth. All the shares and likes helps us out tremendously. They're the key to our growth. <clears throat> Alright. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Whippy whippy. Cool. Hmm. We got this. I think we got this. <laughs> Trying to get this. Hmm. Just die of Bobo. Gosh, he takes a lot of punishment here. And look, he looks like he's constipated when he squats. He looks like he hasn't taken a, a good uh, bathroom break in about three days. Look, see? You need to put more fiber in your diet, sir. Danielle, have I tried Mexican candy? I haven't. Uh, EVB Gamer Yvette's going to send me some Mexican candy one day. And uh, she, she was talking about it. It's the first time I heard of it, actually. I'm really excited to try it. Can we pick up other weapons? No. I don't know if you can drop the weapon you've got, either. Oh, you can. <laughs> now we're going to do some damage. Oh, thank you, Ryan. Appreciate your share, my friend really helps out my man thank you so much all right this is a tricky bit here oh, I love me some candy and some chocolate Jared I do not deny it for a second my friend I'm right, gonna jumpy jumpy over here oh that was close it's always a hard jump to make ah oh, I can't I forgot you can actually run in this double dragon too. I haven't done the run move at all this whole game. There's a lot of enemies here. Hey Zero, good to see you Zero Hyper Gaming, thanks for coming in. Yeah, Tim Tams are pretty good, especially if you're from the United States. Because obviously they're a new kind of gimmick. But I mean, you know, they're not that special over here when you eat them all the time. <laughs> Alright, try again. We're doing much better now compared to the last level at least. I just hope I've got enough continues to get through to the end now. And pick up this Axie Axie. 
Oh, get out of the hole, Rick. There we go. Oh, really, Danielle? What, what should I expect when I eat Mexican candy, then? Everything has chili in it? Yeah, I was expecting it to be chili candy. I love chili, so that's not a problem, my friend. Chili's like one of my most favorite things in the world. <laughs> I can't wait for the Sunfish Tour 2018 and 19. It's going to be so exciting. I finally get to meet all you guys over the next 12 months. Oh, really, Mike? Oh, I appreciate the warning, sir. <laughs> Man, there's so many weapons in this game. That's another thing that makes it awesome. Sorry my face is so itchy today, guys. I think I need to get some beard oil or something. I'm hoping so, Kevin. I would really like to meet you this year. My friend Kevin over in YouTube land, guys, has been with one coin only right from the beginning. And, uh, yeah, even before I started live streaming, Kevin was a member of one coin only. So I ha I'm never going to forget you, my friend. How you doing today, Mike? Good to see you over in YouTube. Oh, sorry, it's Matt. Matt, good to see you over in YouTube land. Thanks for coming in. I don't know what it is with women and beards, but the only reason I keep it is because Mrs. One Coin likes it so much. And she's always like, every day, look Rick, if you don't want to have the beard, I don't mind if you get rid of it, but you can like see the disappointment in her eyes, and I'm just like, nah, I'll keep it. <laughs> yeah man, it's crazy, Kevin. Yeah, whippy whippy. <laughs> oh yes, Jared has a beard, Daniel. <laughs> this is the first beard I've ever grown in my whole life, Mike. I'm 37 years old. And uh, until now, I always looked like a try-hard 15-year-old, you know what I mean? So it took me until almost the age of 40 to finally hit puberty. All right. <laughs> I, I, as I said, I can't remember how many levels are in this game. <sighs> and you know what? That, that's fair as well, isn't it, Menya? And that's coming from a woman right there, so I believe you. Okay, awesome guy, Forks. Appreciate it. <laughs> Something like that, Gareth. Ah, uh, yeah, see, that's what I'm worried about too, Danielle. That's something, trust me, that's crossed my mind. <laughs> I don't think she'd do that to me though, but yeah. Just putting it out there. <laughs> I'm trying to get in the habit of using elbows still, but honestly, these jump kicks that I've been using in this game have just been so much more effective. Because they're almost unblockable. There we go. But pretty, what's pretty cool about this version of Double Dragon is most moves are, are effective against certain enemies or situations. So compared to like Double Dragon 1, for example, you will find yourself using various moves in this game a lot more, which is pretty cool. It's been designed well. There we go. 
How you doing, Retro Vet Gaming? Thank you so much for coming in, my friend. Make sure you like, share, and follow this guy. We appreciate you very much, my sir, for everything you've done. Oh, there you go. That's a first I've heard. Headlock Gaming over in YouTube has just told me he used to have a full beard. You're going to have to rock out with that thing once again, my friend. <coughs> to be honest, I'm a little bit lazy these days too, Roger. That's probably why I've got one. No guy really likes shaving all that much. Ah. Hashtag grow it out, yeah. <laughs> Here you go, you have to grow it out, Headlock Gaming. Ah, oh, man. Oh, just lost another life. Need to concentrate again. Uh, probably not, Roger, no. <laughs> whiskey and chillin'? Man, I wish I had some whiskey in the house. The only liquor I've got at the moment is some tequila. And, uh, I love tequila, but I really feel like some whiskey, actually. I like the old Canadian club. There we go. I don't like the I don't like the kick moves in this double dragon. You either have to use a punch or nothing. Like the jump kick's good, but the regular kick really sucks in this. Anyway, almost got him. Especially now it's winter, whiskey's perfect. <laughs> Funny Dan. Oh, I hear Daniel, yeah. I, I know it's not a pleasant job for everyone. And you've got a lot more of it to worry about. <laughs> I don't mean you, Daniel, I mean ladies. <laughs> oh. oh, really, Joey? Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> In that case, Mayhem Gaming, would you kindly pass me a glass of water, sir? Ah. Uh. This is like level six. I think we're getting close to the end. I do remember this level. As I said, I've only played through this Double Dragon game once. And that was months ago. All right, cool. Ah! Oh! I see how it is. Okay. He just killed himself, douche. Alright, we got it. <clears throat> oh man, it's another tricky one. I'm probably going to have to start using insurance policies here now. I'm going to run across. Alright, we got it. No problem. Swimmy, swimmy, splashy, splashy, all that. Yeah, absolutely, Gareth. <laughs> oh. Alright, we got it. Oh, that was close. I prefer this weapon here. This is pretty sweet. Oh, no, get out of there, Rick. There we go, I nearly killed myself. Hey Peyron, how you doing today, man? This is Double Dragon Advance, my friend. This is the one that came out in Game Boy Advance. It's, uh, it's basically Double Dragon 1.5, like Tyrone said earlier. <coughs> oh, 
man. Oh, yeah, tell me about it, Gareth. It was. Yeah, it's really fun, man. I'm not sure I'm sold on Bimmy's hairstyle here, but apart from that, it's pretty good. Uh, where are you all going? Hmm. Oh, darn it. Alright, much love to you too, Jeremy. We'll see you tomorrow, my man. Get some rest. I hope you're feeling better. Oh, boy. Ha! Almost there. There we go. Big blue bish. Yeah, constipated blue bish. Oh wow, look at this. It's no nonsense. Ah. Oh. like one hit kills if these guys hit you with their swords. It's absolutely brutal. Insurance policy time. How you doing, George? Good to see you today. Thanks for coming in, man. <laughs> Speak speaking of bopping and gangbanging, I really want to uh I really want to play the Warriors on PS2 eventually as well. Do we have any Warriors fans in here? I absolutely love the Warriors, not just for, as a game point of view, but I love the movie too. And uh, I'm actually really surprised no one streamed the Warriors yet. So uh, we're going to definitely do that sooner or later. Alright. Yeah, that's the one. Warriors! <laughs> Come out to play! <laughs> I can't even do it properly, I'm sorry. I won't do that ever again. George wants me to do Double Dragon 3 on NES. I'll definitely give it a go one day, uh, but I always get stuck in the final level, as do most people. Can you dig it? Can you dig it? Good to see you again, X-Bit. <laughs> oh, there we go. We've got Grey Abobo here. He means business. This guy's no bull either. These weapons are pretty OP though, they make life really easy. <clears throat> yeah, it was just, yeah, it was a radio stealer, yeah, Steve. If you've played Warriors on the PS2, it's like a radio stealing simulator basically. <laughs> That's so true, isn't it? There we go. Oh, was it really, Mike? That was a really, really good improv. That that made the movie. That's cool. <laughs> oh, really? You'll have to you'll have to link me to it, Gareth. I used to watch all that stuff. They they did a parody video of the Warriors where the remaining survivors were on the train, like in 2017, and they're all hanging out in their gear. It was really funny. Oh. How are you guys going over in YouTube land? You just chilling? This looks like we're getting pretty close to the end now, if I'm not mistaken. 
I'm gonna have to start using that jump kick again. <laughs> oh, we can we can come down here. That's that's fair enough. This looks like a final final base, doesn't it? Have I played Rondo of, of Blood? Not that version, George. Danielle wants me to play The Sims. I love The Sims. I don't think it'd make a good stream, though, if I'm going to be honest. The Sims is great. There we go. I'm just trying to... Oh, crap. This is close. This is a hard section to get stuck in. I have to go up here. I just keep jump kicking. Oh wait, we got a weapon. <laughs> Gareth wants me to do the Sims as well. I suppose I could do some kind of Sims comedy video. Oh no, Danielle's saying she's playing the Sims while she watches me. <coughs> uh, I don't think Final Fight Streetwise Headlock was that bad a game to be honest, but critically, it was an absolute massive flop. People hated it. Um, I've pl they all think it's boring and repetitive. I played the game and I didn't think it was that bad. But I think most game sites gave Final Fight Streetwise like a 4 out of 10. Oh, I've got to go back down here. I was hoping they'd follow me. Wizard one. I don't even know what that is, Stacy. Yeah, pretty much what Mayhem Gaming said. Oh, really? <laughs> That's funny. You can do all sorts of sadistic things to your sims, and I've done pretty much every one of them back in the day. <laughs> oh, we're almost there. Hey, he's a little bit similar, isn't he? Just gonna wait for this little dragon to do his thing. Alright, we get back out of here. I need to find another weapon again, too. Ah! Yeah, I'm playing on an emulator today, George. I'm playing on a program called Visual Boy Advance. And uh, what's good about Visual Boy Advance is it plays Game Boy, Game Boy Color, and uh, Game Boy Advance games all in the one unit. So it's really, really good. Oh, man. Oh, we got him. Ah. <laughs> hmm. Ah, stop it. Surprised we haven't found that brick section. You know, in this game, uh, originally you'd go in the the final dungeon and you'd have to combat the bricks that slide out of the walls. Surprised we haven't seen that yet. I should try Donkey Kong '94. Geez, George has just come in. He's given me like a multitude of uh, game suggestions already. I'm sure we can do some of your suggestions, George. Oh man. <laughs> That's funny mayhem. Welcome back, Menya. Why'd they do a little bit, Mike? 
They look about three times his size, but I can see the similarity. Oh man, I can't execute the... I'm having trouble getting the elbow going. Anyway, we'll just keep going with the jump kicks for now. Ah! I owe you a Castlevania 3 playthrough, Rodney. We'll do a Castlevania 3 playthrough when I've had a chance to practice. Alright, done. There we go. I love the music in this game. It's a really good remix of all the Double Dragon themes. They've, they've got it spot on, this Game Boy Advance version. Do I like uh, River City Ransom on Game Boy Advance? Yes, we're probably going to be streaming that uh, this week, George. We were just talking about that before you came in. Cool. <laughs> Alright, Rodney, we'll get there, man. We'll get there. Oh, wow, he gets to do a spinny thing and I don't. Ah! Wow. You have to forgive me just for a quick second, guys. I really got my head down in this section. I, th I think we should get this okay, but I'm a little bit paranoid with the fact that we're getting close to the end, and I'm not sure these final two credits is enough, so I'm a bit nervous. <laughs> yeah, he does, George. What's wrong, Menya? You don't seem too happy, my friend. <laughs> All right. This must be the final boss. This is the music for the final boss fight, I'm pretty sure. This was the music in the NES version of uh, Double Dragon 2 The Revenge, I think, for the final boss. Absolutely epic, too. I'll, uh, George just asked me what my thoughts on Double Dragon 3 are. I like the NES version. I think the arcade versions and the Genesis versions can bite me. I can give you some pointers, Ryan. I'd be happy to point you in the right direction, man. We'll talk about it soon. I can help anyone that wants to get into streaming, and I can give you guys a head start. I think I think we, when we cut in when it, ugh, start again. I think when it's when you're a streamer, what's more important is what not to do. There we go. Hey. Is that it? Oh yeah, Stacy wants me to wear a, a green bandana because I've got a green screen behind me. I sometimes wear the green bandana. For some reason, the green screen doesn't pick it up. But I'll, I'll put it on maybe later today. We'll see how it looks. Yeah, I think so, James. I think that's pretty underrated, actually. There we go.
Thank you guys, I think that's the end. There's another level. Oh, okay, we've got one more. Okay. Well, <laughs> it sounded like the final stage music, but we've got one more level. Not over yet, people. It's a little bit of an encore screening here. Thank you, Headlocked. There we go, now we've got to look after these uh, stupid rotating bricks. Everyone loves this level, said no one ever. I'm going to try and run part. I'm going to try and do a big run jump. Ah! Oh, I did it! Oh! Ah! <laughs> wow! That was pretty funny though. Man, this is really tricky. <laughs> awesome. Stabby, stabby. Pikey, pikey. Yeah, this level. Uh, apart from the bricks, I really enjoy this level too. As long as you get past, as long as you get past the bricks, you're sweet. Oh. <laughs> oh, carrying on. Oh no, that was comedy timing right there, wasn't it, Rodney? <laughs> that was funny. Pretty much a carbon copy of the final level in the first game, which which is good. I've got no problem with that. It's a nostalgia trip. There we go. Oh man, We've got the green ones too. Eric, this has been a lot of fun. I can't believe it's been so long since I busted it out. I'll definitely be playing this again. This is really good. These green suckers are tricky though. Uh, yeah, we did Final Fight 1 earlier. Uh, I, I think you might have missed it, but it was great. That was fun too. We played as Jailbird Cody as well. Still got one credit handy. Ah. Hmm. Oh, come at me, bro. There we go, we got him. Yeah, not wrong. Here we go. Oh look, there's Marion up there. And this is the most epic of epicness tunes. <laughs> Everyone loves this theme. What a fitting way to end the game. Oh. <laughs> Final Fight is your all-time favorite game. It's 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 definitely up there for me, at least as far as beat 'em ups go, Eric, for sure. It's fantastic. I don't think it's in my top five. I think it's in my top ten games.
What are my thoughts of Cody being uh, the mayor on Street Fighter V? Cody for president, that's what I say, George. Cody should be president. Alright. Oh. We're taking on all of Justin Bieber's bodyguards now. Um, you know what? I think Final Fight 1 is absolutely fantastic, but there's just so much variety in this Game Boy Advance version of, of Double Dragon. I do have to admit, I think this game is better. There's just so much in this to see and do. It's just a nice hybrid of a bunch of Double Dragon games. Wacky wacky, yes. <laughs> batty batty. Alright. And the combat in this is a lot of fun. I think I think what made made this game is honestly this jump kick. <laughs> Fair enough, Cody, I was only teasing. Ah, shooty, shooty. <sighs> oh, really, Tyrone? I didn't even know that, man. Jeez, that's something. Have I played the Master System version of Double Dragon? Oh, absolutely. That was the first Double Dragon game I ever played, Neil. The Master System of Double Dragon version is really easy until you get to the final level. And then it's incredibly OP. Uh, I, I can't finish the Master System of version of Double Dragon without um, doing that code at the end where you jump. Well, what is it again? You jump like... 40 times in the air in order to get all those lives. How you doing, ADD Gamer? Good to see you, my man. Like, share, and follow. Good to have you, Dan. You came just in time for the ending, my friend. Your host, Ricky Diz, is about to go and get some sushi. <laughs> Oh, did you do it legit, Kevin? Or did you use the jump trick as well? Man, massive respect if you can do that. I don't have the talent for it. Thank you, Gareth. Thank you, Tyrone. I really love the elbow in this, but I just kept getting surrounded too much. Yeah, eight missions in this one, George. I do. <laughs> I can't deny it, Mike. Ah, oh, so thanks so much for coming in, guys. Enjoy the credits. We'll have a quick chat before we log off. And, uh, you rock too, sir. We are the Sunbish Army. We all rock here. Oh, yeah, Headlock Gaming brought up the Atari 2600 version of Double Dragon. It was a mess, bro. It's one of the worst games of all time. Um... There's also an Atari uh, 7800 version of Double Dragon that's not much better. Uh, the Amiga version of Double Dragon, uh, I think that suffered from loading times. There's a lot of bad ports of Double Dragon too. I'm very fortunate as a kid I played all the good ones. Thank you, Roger. Wow. Well done, Kevin. Kevin can actually uh, beat the Master System version of Double Double Dragon without cheating. That's that's a pretty big achievement. Thank you, James. So, uh, just reminding you guys, we are on uh, Xbox Gaming. Uh, when are we going to be on there? Probably in about two hours. 
and uh, I'm going to be doing Adventure Island 2 and a very surprise Super Mario Bros. 2 hack. So uh, for all you people that are sleepless, we're going to be doing a 3 hour stream on Xbox Gaming in a couple hours. Hope to see you if you can stay awake. And uh, that's it for us in this stream, guys. Thank you so much for coming in. You enjoy the rest of your evening. We'll see you soon. Also, we've got the one coin only shop if you want a hoodie or a tee. Just reminding you of the XBig Gaming stream team as well. You guys have been awesome. We'll see you again soon. Take it easy, everyone.